There are more than 14,000 homeless children in the Clark County School mm -hmm. District, and of those 14,000, there are more than 1,000 homeless youth alone on the streets, completely by themselves without any parents. And with school being out for summer, these kids have nowhere to go all day, and they don't get those free meals. But there is a local group looking to cut those numbers. We're about to introduce you to one of the volunteers and some of the people he helps every single day. It's about two o'clock on a Friday, and while most of us are counting down the hours until the weekend, looks like we're getting ready to go. Rico Ocampo's work is just beginning. All right, let's do this. Rico's headed to his weekly practice, Feel Good Friday. I'm really excited to show the community what we're doing. There is a, a hidden gem behind Las right, Vegas. One of those gems is Feel Good Friday. Rico is a part of the Nevada Partnership for Homeless Youth. And what feels good about his Fridays is this. These are my kids. A line of homeless children waiting for help. These kids are hurting and not many people know about it. Waiting in 115 degree heat. And even though they need these services, a lot of them are lining up with the smile on their face. So let's go ahead. All the items are going to come out. On this Feel Good Friday, Rico and a group of volunteers are set up at the Siegel Suites near Flamingo in Maryland. Today they're handing out toothbrushes, food, water, and something a lot of us take for granted, shoes. How long do you think they wait, they wait out here before people even get here? Some have waited between 30 minutes and an hour. I need someone to give out waters. Either it can be 60 degrees and raining and they'll still be under this um, parking garage or it can be 115 degrees and they'll still be there. One of those waiting in line. And what's your name? Michael. So what was your favorite part about going through that line? Getting the water. Why does that stick cold? See these kids and knowing that they're coming back on a daily basis and some of them line up without their parents, so they take it upon themselves. Can you help him find a shoe for his mom? We gotta make a brand new shoes. That how many want fast? How excited are you to have those new shoes? A hundred. We had um, 80 kids. 80 kids we were able to see. I think that's 80 kids too much. These are just 80 of the more than 14,000 homeless students in the Clark County School District. I was a little excited to get the shoes. How come? They found me, Michael. That is Rebecca Marion, Michael and Jordan's mom. Oh, before I came to the Seagull Suites, I was homeless. You know, I had to take it one day at a time. She says the smallest things handed out at Feel Good Friday make the biggest difference to those who are struggling. All I can do is thank him because it helped me out a lot. Thank you. There's no better way to get back than with kids, too, because I think that they see adults doing it, and maybe one day they'll grow up and they'll give back. Graduate today. We graduated today. Come on, man. Things. You're going to be an example for him, uh -huh. you're going to be an example for him so that they don't drop out and they go to school and they can get, make it out of here. Okay. Rico and the Nevada Partnership for Homeless Youth's efforts extend far beyond Feel Good Friday. We are actually canvassing by foot. We are actually walking around the areas where people don't want to go to. Uh, there are certain areas where people tend to avoid and those are the areas where the youth will be. Every week, Rico and his team share the same goal. We are in the business of eradicating homelessness here in Southern Nevada. It's, it's become too much of an issue. It's become more than that. It is an epidemic. An epidemic he hopes you at home are now aware of and want to help tackle. Feel Good Friday is an open invitation to anyone who wants to come out and give back. There's kids out here who need help. There's youth out here who need help. But we're, we're out here and we're making sure that they they know that they're not forgotten. At a partnership for homeless youth is always looking for volunteers. You can donate money, donate goods, or you can even help out at Feel Good Friday if you want. We have that information for you on our website. And this was just part one of our look into youth homelessness in Clark County. You are doing another version at six o'clock. Yeah, coming up on Fox 5 News at six, I'm gonna introduce you to two amazing young men who through no fault of their own mm -hmm. became homeless here in Clark County, really through the actions of their families, their parents. But they, I mean, the, the, the resiliency is so astounding and inspiring. And we're gonna share their story with you uh, coming up here on Fox 5 News at six o'clock. Yeah, just spending a day with those people, it's just so eye-opening. So I really hope you, our viewers at home, 
it's eye-opening for you and hopefully people can help out and do some good. Yes, mm -hmm. and we'll have that information again, how you can donate or volunteer yes. with Nevada Partnership for Homeless Youth on our website.